Hello, my name is Hugh Rooney. I'm a dry stock advisor based in County Louth. And at Sheep 2015, I was covering the workshop selecting lambs for slaughter. So the main areas of focus today was encouraging farmers to look at the lambs a bit more closely. So firstly, I'd like them to identify their key markets, talk to the processors, and ask the processors what is the ideal specification that they're looking for, and then try and suit the, the lambs to meet their specifications. So once you get an ideal carcass weight from the processor, you can use uh, kill-out percentages uh, to work out your drafting weights. Kill-out percentages can vary from 44% for lambs on grass in the autumn to up to 48% in mid-season or just off the, the yews. Weigh the lambs regularly, check for fat scores. After that, cleanliness is a big area. So we, we'd like farmers to check the, around the tail area for any fecal contamination because any contamination may lead to a reduced shelf life uh, on the product. So the next area is the area of handling the lambs. Lambs are very, when they're young, they're quite tender and they bruise quite easily. And a bruised carcass may need to be trimmed and the more trimming the factory does, the less weight will be for the farmer. When you're handling the lamb, you don't pull the wool. You, you put one hand under the chin of the lamb and the other hand at the tail in order to minimise any, any bruising. It's also a good idea to fast lambs for a minimum of one hour before transport. This allows the gut to empty and will result in cleaner lambs on, on arrival at the factory. If the lambs are quite wet, it's a good idea to house them on straw for a number of hours to, until they dry. This will result in a, a dry lamb arriving at the factory and less contamination. Make sure you transport in a, a clean, dry trailer. Don't overcrowd the trailers as this can cause bruising as well. So in summary, I'd be encouraging farmers to weigh the lambs regularly, handle the lambs regularly, check for fat scores and uh, check for weights and have a, a weight range in mind of about three to five kilos and, and drafts in those weights and transport in clean, dry, not overly stocked trailers.